हेलो एवरी वन वेरी वेलकम टू ऑल ऑन माई चैनल वंस अगेन एंड दिस इज रश्मि सिन्हा एंड यूर एम बैक विथ माई वन मोर एजुकेशनल वीडियो विच वॉज लेफ्ट दिस इज द चैप्टर क्लास सेवन चैप्टर वन लास्ट पार्ट विच वॉज लेफ्ट एंड इन द लेसन वॉज कंप्यूटर हार्डवेयर कंपोनेंट्स एंड टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू कवर सम टॉपिक्स विच वॉज लेफ्ट इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो एंड द टॉपिक विच आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद द एक्सटर्नल हार्डवेयर बट दे आर इनपुट डिवाइसेज एंड दीज इनपुट डिवाइसेज द फर्स्ट इज विच आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर हेयर दैट इज माइक्रोफोन यू होप यू ऑल नो दैट वॉट एक्चुअली द माइक्रोफोन इज इन माई मोबाइल और इन द टैबलेट और द लैपटॉप एवरीवेयर देर इज अ माइक्रोफोन प्रेजेंट एंड वॉट डज इट वॉट इज द फंक्शन ऑफ द माइक्रोफोन टू रिकॉर्ड to store or to convert this audio in a wave files w a v wave files they convert it in a wave files and the narrations whatever the audio we are giving it that narration uh, is converted in ppt that is powerpoint presentations also and we are mostly using in a video conferencing suppose when we are talking to someone or to share your uh, audios to others so by that here we are using in the microphone is a very major device to use in a video conferencing please make sure that you are writing everything that you have any problem or doubt about any of the gadget or the device please watch my previous videos which i have made for the smaller classes because there the elaborations are given so you will be easily getting it and still you have any problem please mention down in my query so we hope you get it the next topic is the next topic is light pen light pen um, like a normal pen but it functions on a tablets or in the uh, costly mobiles like galaxy s10 and that these are um, hand these costly gadgets contain this light pen this light pen functions like a normal mouse but it's it is very sensitive and uh, its function is to pointing it function as a pointing device it selects or modify the data and on it is working as a touch screen like you can swipe the data has on your touch screens so this works there and mostly the students or the people using them those who are working on cad like computer aided design they draw something like they design something building or uh, they design some models or they do some kind of designing work so for them this is a very useful device so light pen is a uh, like a uh, normal mouse but it functions on a costly gadgets now move to the next device which is digital camera that's our favorite one na digital camera is a very attractive and a favorite gadget of everyone and digital camera presents in all the costly gadgets in the which is available in the market all the costly mo mobile contains a uh, digital camera and what it does it makes both the pictures still pictures miss which uh, we are going to print it and the digital pictures also these images which you take from these digital camera can be edited can be viewed or can be um, print by the printers so you can uh, review them and you can print them before reviewing them so this is also one, one more thing and online chatting during online chatting or online conferencing also we require these digital camera very much functionable so this is a great device so now move to the external hardware storage device these which we discussed these were the input one now we are going to talk about the storage devices so or uh, sorry output devices the um, external hardware which function as a output the first output device which is the very common is monitor monitor uh, the full the generally the computer name of monitor is vdu and vdu may be visual display unit and sometimes the people call it video display unit both the terms are correct the amazing fact about monitor is whatever you see on the monitor the pictures and the graphs and the graphics and all you won't believe they are made up of millions of dots they are not drawn they are made up of their com combination of the so many millions of dots and these dots are called pixels we call them pixels the monitor helps us to make the soft copy of any of the graphics or pictures or the text which appear on the screen so this is a uh, very important important about monitor you must know and we have three types of monitor available in the market which i have already discussed in my junior classes videos you may go through 
and they are CRT which functions on cathode ray tubes you might have known might be knowing about cathode ray have you seen the tube lights there is a white powder in it and the rays are creating the light so that is actually called cathode you must have studied in a chemistry the second is elite lcd the full form of lcd is liquid crystal display this is the second type of monitor available in the market they are flat screen one and the third the best one the expensive one is led led's full form is light emitting diode so this these three monitors available in the market now move to the next output device and that is okay the next is printer so that's the amazing one we print everything by that printer and printers are actually called a peripheral device because they are not much required for any computer but if it is of your use you must add it and it may accept the text the graphics as a out and gives you as the output in a on a page on a printer gives the all the soft copies converted in a hard copy so these are soft copy you'll get it on a paper which is called a hard copy these informations they can be connected to the computer by help of port which is usb or maybe by the wi-fi so both of the options are given there and we have two types of printer printer available in the market the first is, is the impact printer and the second is non-impact what type of impact printers available in the market that is daisy wheel and dot matrix the common one what they do they have a physical contact with the the printer has a physical contact with the paper and they create a strike on that paper by this process and they print the characters on the printer so this is the way of daisy wheel and dot matrix but the non impact printers are the better one and the expensive one and the example of the <clears throat> non impact printer is that is laser printer or the inkjet printer you know the difference between um, impact and non impact is that non impact one have no touch with the paper and the printer what they do they create a laser light on the paper and creates the strike of the character or the graphics you wanted to print on the paper so this is the major difference they don't touch it the paper and by the light rays they function so next is projector very very common and you all have seen must have seen the projector you all are very much liking to go to the pvrs and you have seen in your school also some projector programs so projectors are act generally we have seen in a cinema halls and for the teaching it purpose it is being used or for the meetings it being used so uh, the uh, function of this projector devices what they do they take the image and generate take the image from the computer and display that larger image on a big screen or on any flat surface so that is the only function of projector and that's a amazing device now we have reached to the some storage devices and we'll start from the hard disk the hard disk is present in inside the cpu in a cabinet and this is a magnetic storage device used to store and retrieve data retrieve means if you lost it or if you are not getting or you wanted to copying that data that will be done by the hard disk because it is retrieving this is collection of disk and these disk are called platter we call them these disk are called platter please remember it is little critical one so these disk are called platter and these platters are not going to touch each other but they are kept one on one on each other like this and what they do they consist two read write and uh, sides they have to read write sides heads you can say and they together creates a track and this track location the cut across all platter is called the cylinder so we have four names uh, in the hard disk the hard disk is made up of platter and these platters are containing the disk and these uh, sorry disk is made up of uh, known as platter and then the platter consist the data which is called the tracks and then later it is called cylinder so this is the function of all hard disk hard disk old name is winchester disk because it was made by ibm in 1973 and they have kept this name of the hard disk now move to the second device of which is also called as a storage device and very common that is cd and cd's full form is compact disk 
this is read only because it is written cd rom so compact disk read only memory so you are only allowed to read you cannot do any kind of change in it so uh, it is pre recorded and you cannot make any kind of change in it so all the data all the data like audios videos graphs and images uh, can be carried by the cd and the capacity of cd is 650 mb to 900 mb and that is um, measured the speed of the data which uh, is being re read by the cd is um, called in a kilobyte per second the speed of the data is uh, counted in kilobyte per second now we have two types of cd in the market one is cd r and another is cd rw the cd r is cd which is readable and the cd rw is readable writable or rewritable you can say means you can erase and write it again so that cd is also available in the market the second is dvd which is in, introduced in the market in 1995 and far far better than cd you won't believe it is six times uh, larger than a cd's capacity and full form of dvd is digital versatile disc but sometimes we call it digital video disc also that is also correct name and its high storage speed is also better quality is also better and as i told you the speed of a dvd is 4.6 gb to 17 gb which is uh, 25 times better than cd now we are uh, reaching to the third device which is also in a cd category and this is blu ray disc this is very new launched in the market and um, new optical we call it this is a new optical disc uh, and little expensive also but the best quality it works on a violet blue violet rays or laser light it works and its capacity is 25 gb to 50 gb my god too much and it is six times better than dvd one point i left that is dvd is also of three types and, and available in the market dvd r which is for the reading dvd w rw which is for uh, rewritable one and the combination of dvd which is reading and writing both it can do so we have reached to the last point of the video and that is flash drive flash drive uh, in one word i can say have you seen the pen drives the thumb drives or the pen drives they are just example of flash drive these are the small portable data storage devices which can easily transfer any kind of audio video data images graphs everything they are re removable and rewritable means once you have carried one data you may easily remove it or erase it and write it again it is too easy to do it is connected by usb this that is universal serial bus and it contains a pcb what is that pcb printed circuit board which helps the pen drive to save that data or to collect that data which you are which you wanted to carry and not only this this is uh, protected means insulated so the data which you are going to carry by pen drive that not going to be uh, virus affected and as well as not going to be harmed and uh, you won't believe the um, capacity of a pen drive which now it is launched in the market that is 1 tb to 2 tb which is too too much means in terabytes it is so that's all for today and that's all for my playlist of chapter 1 which was running for class 7 it is done if you have any query as i told you please mention down thank you goodbye have a nice day